yeah, I essentially I think I just slipped a little bit in some footholds on that delivery and my head went down and I kind of lost all side of it. I don't even know if it was, I think it was a pretty hideous delivery, I, I didn't even see it. And then I kind of looked up and the lights um, were a little bit in my eyes and <laughs> I think the first time I spotted the ball was pretty much just before it hit my arm. Um, and then yeah, it, <laughs> rather embarrassingly um, I managed to catch it but I think I provided a lot of entertainment for everyone um, and I lost all composure and I'm really glad Rachel took me off after that. So. <laughs> That's all I've got for you. I, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not sure, I think, because it was just so embarrassing. So I'm just laughing instead. But, like, I suppose um, in cricket, everyone bowls some good balls and you don't get wickets. And every now and then you bowl some bad ones or you have a bit of luck or something obscure happens. And that's what makes the game so fun and entertaining. Um, and it was nice, um, yeah, obviously being Sarah Taylor as well to... To dismiss her and I think you know you'd happily get her out any way possible but um yeah I don't think it had anything to do with my skill or ability that that wicket um it was pure luck <laughs> yeah I think it was a really nice finish to the day um you know those two wickets probably makes it um yeah a really good day for us before that was probably a, an okay day so um yeah just to finish strongly like that and um I guess be patient all day too because it's quite nice conditions out there and I thought England batted pretty well for, for most parts of the day so um, yeah it was a really good finish under lights there and um, yeah nice to see Talia take a few wickets in her first uh, test match and I thought she bowled really well. Uh, amazing um, for so many reasons obviously test matches are incredibly special for us and we love playing them but um, to come out onto a, a North Sydney Oval that looked like it did today and then to see the, the people that rolled in and the atmosphere that it created, um, yeah, I think it's just a monumental step forward for, for women's cricket and um, I think a huge amount of kudos goes to Cricket Australia for them um, creating what they have today and hopefully the next three days are, are more of the same but I thought it was just, yeah, a huge highlight of my career really. Yeah, that's always really special too, and I think because we don't pay, play tests too uh, regularly, there's always a few debutants, and um, certainly a bit of emotion. We're really fortunate to have three greats of the game come down and present, present in Christina Matthews, Belinda Clark, and Belinda Robertson. So, um, you know, just having them there um, and being able to acknowledge them and what they've done for the game as well, and then them passing on the, the caps to the girls. Um, yeah, it's really nice, and their family were there too. So, um, yeah, I think it's such a special day one when that happens, and it was really nice to see, you know, how chuffed, chuffed the girls were. Gosh, that was the same over. As, <laughs> yeah, it wasn't <laughs> wasn't a great over. Um, <laughs> oh look, yeah, honestly, it, it probably did a little bit, um, but I probably had a little bit. Yeah, I guess more composure after that because of what happened in Cross Harbour and um, you know, I bowled the next ball cross seam and um, yeah, there's a bit of dew around and for whatever reason I have quite sweaty palms so um, it, it uh, popped out but yeah, I, it's fine, it, it happened so I'm glad I didn't bowl the second one.